Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. I'm in this scary ass forest. In the possibility of death, you know, being very, very close by. I don't know what's gonna happen. I still haven't got my reward for the hundred and thirty bars I've been playing beats that are red. <laughs> Just to point out. <laughs> I'm not close. <laughs> what's gonna happen? <laughs> Oh thank god, Hagrid! Hagrid, god, you'll not believe what I've just been through! Take me back! I see you found the unicorn's blood trail, Harry. I don't understand what would be killing the unicorns. Never heard anything like it before. Never have I, There's honestly. There's in these woods that shouldn't be. Be careful now and stay with the path. Call me if you find anything. <laughs> can't, you, can't you just stay with me? <laughs> You just said it's really dangerous. Can't you stay with me so I don't die? I'm gonna die. I don't wanna die. I don't even know why I'm in here. I just help the little dragon go home to have a new family. <laughs> I'm going to die. I don't, to die. I don't know how I've managed to produce real tears. <laughs> I'm impressed. I wish I had that on face cam just to show the real tears. I've never been able to actually do that before. That's something, eh? Being able to produce real tears when you're <laughs> when you're acting like you're actually crying. I'm impressed with myself. I really am impressed. <laughs> anyway, enough ego robbing. Let's go the opposite way of the blood and show you. Oi! Stick your ass up where I can see it. Bullshaka! It doesn't really matter about the power of the Flipendo, it's gonna hurt it nonetheless. Case on point. Come on, stick it up. Stick your ass up. There we go. Okay. You seem to be good. <gasps> huh. Was I the only one that's the famous one, Witches and Wizards card? Oh, yeah. First person mode. I do. I'm guessing we're just gonna have to knock it from the sky. Wow. Look at the sky. It's gruesome. What's are those blue things over there? The lights are blue. Doesn't matter. I mi- Oh! Got it! Dun 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 dun! Rowena Ravenclaw. I'm good. Alright. Seriously though, the sky looks daunting. I think you can only like see it from a distance when I'm not in first person mode. Okay. Let's go up. What is with this, by the way? Is, can I go down there or something? Doesn't appear to be. I think it's just there for aesthetics. Alright, let me jump up. What's the point of that ledge if you can just hop right up here? Who cares? Um, why do we have a loading screen? <gasps> oh no! <gasps> you! You've been following me around this whole game! Come on. I'm not afraid of you. Okay, I'm terrified! Anyway! 
Well, I'm dead. The end. Harry was rescued in the nick of time by the centaur Firenze and rode on his back to safety. Firenze explained that unicorn blood had the power to keep someone alive who was an inch from death. Harry realized that the hooded figure he'd seen in the clearing was none other than he who must not be named. Lord Voldemort. You just said he who must not be named, so you then name him. Contradictory, much? Oh, that was a close shave, Harry. Any creature that would kill a unicorn and drink its blood is one to be avoided at all costs. So why did I follow him? Lord Vol I mean, he who must not be named. And you better be on your guard. He's a dangerous foe. Oh, you've got a present for you, Harry. I made it myself. Some creatures find music very relaxing. If you play the right tune, you can send them to sleep. In fact, I remember this very tune that I used to play to my Fluffy. Try it out on this barn owl I've been looking after. He needs a good long sleep. Like a light. I wish Fluffy was as easy to send to sleep. But you'd best be getting back to your lessons now. Thanks again, Harry. You're a real friend. I hate you, Hagrid. You sent me off to the middle of the Forbidden Forest, which is not only forbidden, but you just said anyone that drinks unicorn blood I've is to be avoided. I've been some reading about Nicholas Flamel, the wizard going? that Hagrid mentioned. He's the creator of the Philosopher's Stone. Supposedly, it can grant eternal life to its user. If it's here, there may be snakes after it. There are even rumours that you know who's involved. We have to find a way to get past Fluffy. That must be where the stone is being kept. Why do we have to do this? Ron and I will meet you on the third floor by the doorway that leads to Fluffy. We have to get the stone first. Come on, Ron, let's go. I suppose. Um... Hmm. We finally made it. Nice one, Harry. You've got the beans we needed. The portrait password is Wolf Spain. Thank Thanks you. for the beans, Harry. You're welcome. We'll make sure they find a good home. <laughs> Have you heard the rumor? There's a troll on the loose around here. Smells worse than Percy's socks, and that's saying something. I chased that goddamn thing. Well, I got chased by that goddamn thing. Where's the portrait? Table? Come down. Thank you. Where's the portrait room? Where is that goddamn portrait room? Is it over here? I, I can't remember where the portrait room is. <laughs> 